Now special request to all the girls from North, South, East and West For everybody look good, I know you have the God bless Brrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
uh, from from my little youth music of Jamaica. Yes. See? Yes. But, um, like in my early teens, mm -hmm. I go back to Jamaica and then my cousin and my used to roll with. Yes. Who was used to MC. Right. See? So then, then them kind of show me one and two little roads and things like that. Them are camera around mm -hmm. on the ends and things where they have little sound systems. So I used to DJ on the sound them are like a link state and you are done. Yes. See? And then uh, when, when we come back from the vacation now, yes. we come back and spend some time in Manchester and things. So we are DJ for a song in Manchester called Youth Man. But then, Bless up Youth Man sound. But then once we um, once back in London, we start DJ for a song for a song and then called Sledge And then yes. there's my main song in DJ for. Alright, Sledge Hammer sound, yes. bless it up. Now, what are some of your greatest memories of being a part of a sound system? Yeah. <laughs> you see that smile too much. <laughs> uh, funny enough, I think it's it's uh it's the uh, sound is lifting back still then. Wow. And being in the stage I used to have quad box. So a four four eighteen inch. Wow, so that's a heavy box to lift up for those yeah. who don't know sound system. Yeah, so right. Being able to hang on one side of that. Wow. From my own. Wow. Yeah, that that probably was yeah. yeah. One of the and you know, things. it's such a ground it's such a great foundation for men to be a part of a sound system. You know, the you discipline see? and the unity and the love, you know, it's a great it's a great thing. Mm -hmm. So can you now name your top three sound systems? Top three sound system? Mm-hmm. Um it's hard, I know. <laughs> yeah, no, it's really easy that one this thing. Um, Coxon. Yes. Saxon. Yes. King of these. Respect. Now, any artists out there that you would like to work with? That you haven't worked with already, maybe? That I haven't worked with. You know, so I try to do my work with. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> um, different thing. Yeah. Uh, Oh yes, mm. yes man. Mm. Yeah, me love them vibes too. All right, where was the last event you played at? You know, because right now we know in this time it's quite difficult for artists to perform. Mm -hmm. Where was your last event? Um, the last event which we do was a private event in Loughborough. Uh huh. Um, earlier this year. Right. Um, so yeah, it was like a private party thing. Mm. See what? Yeah, it was a. Nice vibes and things too. Great. Big up to our love for massive them we're bringing up this thing. Right? Respect. Mm. Now you know Top Cat, you know, you've had mainstream success, you've had grassroots success, underground success, you've had it all. Can you recall some of your best moments within your legendary career? Quite a few still me, me, me do Japan Splash in 1996. Yes. And before that, uh, a couple of weeks before we do Atlanta Splash. Yes. Um, just before the, the Olympic Games in Atlanta. Mm -hmm. um, so now I be show them where, where, where my got to stay because they're going to deal with uh, Sugar Minot, mm -hmm. Judy Moat, Capitan mm -hmm. um, and Dennis Brown. Oh, great. You see? Oh, mad. <laughs> mad. Yeah, you see, each, yes. each and every one will come on. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, when Sugar come on, I said, boy, I don't know anybody on the top where him just All right. Him. Yeah, then Julie Moore come on. When she come on, I said, boy, I don't know anybody on the top. All right. Yeah. Layers and levels. When, then when Capitan come on, I said, no, 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 It's done. Yeah. It's done. Yeah. You see? <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, and Dennis Brown come on, he will talk about our favorite team. Oh, my uh, God. I best show me what I see. Yes, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. That, that is a classic, definitely. So can you please name us your three top types of music genres? Reggae dancer, mm -hmm. um, roots reggae, yes. jungle. All right. Now, professionally, what what would you say is your goal? You've achieved so much in your career. Professionally, as my goal, um, when we see the music, I'm a real musician. Mm -hmm. yeah. If music is a thing where we just do it as a little hustle. Mm -hmm. you, do me, you do music, you might last. Like, like if, a comp if a major company sign a band, yes. more time still, if them successful, they may last for, for between three to five years. True. Then that's the end of that. Mm -hmm. New one, them come in and yes. things, and you forget about that. Yes, yes. 
if you're a real musician, in the last three years, in the last five years, in the last ten years, it's something where it's a part of your way, something where you do. See, so irrelevant if sometimes you might have a do a, a next little thing, which is which the next whether you realize it or not, the next little thing mm. is a side also. Yes. See, but the music are your real thing because music is your expression of who you are, where you really do. I love that answer because you know, so much of us do have to have that hustle and it's just the love of the music that keep us all, you know, focused and determined on the mission. So in saying that, Top Cat, what other jobs have you had to do while being an artist? Well, Any nine to five? As a nine to five, I'm not sure. I've, I've worked in a local government. Mm -hmm. So I've been a local government manager yes. in a different uh, department. Excellent. Great. All right. Now, if you could go back in time, if you could wave that magic wand, as they say, would you do anything differently, Top Cat? Why? Musically. <laughs> no, why well, I don't well, well, really, really know about that and things like, like certain things that we do and things like that. I will go back just to do it one more time. <laughs> <laughs> Good answer. I love that answer. Yeah. Such a great answer. True, true. You enjoy it too much. Yeah, yeah. yeah all I right, mean, now. Yeah. With all the many years you have, under your belt as an artist and as a performer. Mm. Do you still get nervous before a performance? Come from sound system. I mm -hmm. don't know when you're going to sleep. <laughs> At you, a sound system, you, you yeah, can't come, come from sound system, so I don't know when you're going to sleep. You know, right. so, yes, so, we have something for that. All right, yeah, yeah. yeah simple. simple yeah. But how do you handle your mistakes while doing a live performance, if you make mm -hmm. one? How do you handle it? Think of style of <laughs> yeah, yeah, that thing, style it out. Mm. And you wouldn't know. Yeah. All right. And even if, even if you don't know, I think still a chop. Yeah. You style it out. Right now, I move on with that one. Yeah, simple. Simple. All right. Mm. So in saying that now, what advice could you give to any beginners who have those jitters and nerves? Learn for style out. <laughs> <laughs> Straight. <laughs> I love that. I love that. Yeah. So. Top Cat, you know, we love you, we love your vibes and your energy straight up. What more, what else can we expect from you in the future? Well, you can expect more music will come from me, with, which is looking for forward the music. Definitely. Yeah, machine. And, and pioneer new things. Yes. Uh, yes, back in, our back in the 90s, mm -hmm. Weiss was used to pioneer. Um, the UK genres that was coming at the time. Definitely, so yes. both in jungle and, and in UK garage. Yes. See, so that's that's where that's mm -hmm. where when we look for it, continue yes. and come up with things like that and thing like me right first before me write a book about how for MC. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Them, them say you can't do something like that because you either have it or you don't have it. You just pick up the mic and do it. And I look at this as a foolish and stuff. See, so I break down the techniques and everything. Wow. You know, I write the first book and that and things. So it's another first one to do. Excellent. See, so it's all about pioneering things yes. and things. Like so I think when we see and things, I mean, we can put my energy in it where mm -hmm. it, can, it can help people. Yes, see, that that's, that's what I look for. Them. Excellent. You know, it's all about being groundbreaking and being unique and that is what will always set you apart now do you have any message top cat for don sinclair and unruly cooley about the great works that they are doing promoting artists yeah man yeah. keep up the great work because i don't know sir i watch everything we are going on <laughs> see enough people i watch what i go on and love what i go on so keep it up respect respect and respect in every aspect yeah. We say a real sound man with David today, you know, the legend, the artist who we call Top Cat. And on behalf of me, Alison Mason, for Shining Stars, representing as always your girl for Don Sinclair Reggae Vibes YouTube. Thank you once again, Top Cat, for your time. Respect. Utmost respect. respect.